What's up, everybody? How y'all doing? Was that too loud? I don't know. I'm learning how to do this. So, this Sherry. Sherry, don't try to stop trying to hide. So, stop trying to hide. So, uh, right now, we're in the office. Um, this is like our conference room or like, you know, our quiet room or whatever. And so, we're just in here um, going through our, uh, like, all our clients and, like, prospects and stuff. You know, because, so we're in the business of real estate. We're realtors. And so, like, um... In this business, you have to constantly keep, you know, doing something like, you know, and making business because it's not like you're getting a check or, you know, or anything like that. This is like something like you have to go out and make, you know, some business. So um, the average realtor does like six homes a year. And that's like, you know, that, if that's, you know, great for them. But if you want to make like, you know, serious income and, and be like, you know, what all the, everybody says nowadays, like financially independent, you got to do this all day long. You know, it can get quite like overwhelming, but you know, like I said before, but man, when you start helping a lot of families and doing like, you know, making just, just doing a lot of business and, you know, having a lot of clients, it's like a, like an overflow just starts happening. Um, I'm not as good as Sherry yet, you know, you can see she's so, she's so like tuned in and she's so good and she's always killing it, you know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, you got to do this like all day. Like, um, you do. we, we aspire to be like, uh, like our broker, Lily. Like, this woman's, you know, she's amazing. She's like a beast mode. She's like that all the time. She's in the office every day and on the phones. And someone to be at her level of success, you know, closing over like 80, 90 million a year and still do those essentials, that, that's amazing. Because, you you know, telling your team to do something, but you doing it like even more, that's just even more impressive. So that's why we in here just grinding it out all day, every day, out of the bed, you know, just not taking any time off man just going hard but when those uh when that commission start coming in after you close it is a wonderful thing Ooh, Ooh, yeah, i'm gonna get that right <laughs> but yeah but uh but you know in this business too you know like when you work a regular job you get paid like every week or two weeks yeah, as a, yeah. i remember that <laughs> as an entrepreneur now nah, you can't expect yeah. you there's no such thing as a promise check mm -hmm. you know you First, when you meet a, a client or seller or a buyer, or just to say a buyer, you know, it's 30 days. You know, they find a home within, you know, two weeks, three weeks, but then it's another 30 days after that when they close because, you know, they have to wait for the loan and stuff like that. I'll go through that in another vlog. But it, it takes it takes around 60 days for you to get a paycheck from that one person. So that's why you see you have to grind that hard. You know, it is it is a lot of sacrifice, but man, like if you grind it out and work hard and up in the morning before everybody and just hitting the phones, you will start making some progress and like in, in getting it. But this is not a business for the week. You know, it's it's not like well, uh, or for a person who wants a relationship. Yeah, like I don't yeah. even have a relationship. Yeah. <laughs> My sister makes fun and says, Hey Sherry, you'll never meet anyone, but I love what I do. Yeah, but look, yeah, then you do a sale that's astronomical and you like shoot you don't even worry about it because it's i'm telling you it's really great money if you if you can make it happen if you can't i mean then it's it's like it's nothing there but you have to keep pushing and keep grinding at it like any other business you know if you're an entrepreneur and you're watching this like you got to keep grinding every second man because if you don't it's it's a wrap for you it's like case in point so she had met a client three uh three weeks later the client closes like what three four weeks it took for, for them, how long did it take for the, for you to meet them and then for it to close? Um, not even thirty days. Not even thirty days, and the the sale was up like what five seventy five? Uh, no, it was five ten. Five ten. But it was originally priced much higher. But you called it. You negotiated. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So yeah, you gotta. You, that's a big part too. You gotta save your clients. You gotta you know respect their money like it's your own. Yes. But. She did a sell five hundred. The sell was five hundred ten thousand. So as a realtor, you get paid three percent of that sell. So she just made oh, in thirty days. She just made over fourteen grand. You see what I'm saying? So it's not like uh, like you gotta wait thirty days. You know, without that, you know, if you don't have no other clients for that check or you know for that that property to close. But when it closes and it's big, look what type of look what type of money you're making. You know, what, look what you're able to do for your family and do for yourself. I mean, it, it's amazing. And you got some money to go splurge, shop, get a purse, you know, or red bottoms, whatever you like to do. So that just shows you like it. It is a sacrifice, but it's a great sacrifice. It actually it gives you something back with it. So that's awesome. 
So we're gonna get back to doing this. I got the lights over here. Don't it look good? I just got a haircut. Yeah, I got a haircut. So that's always awesome. Sherry got a haircut too. Yes. It's like that cover girl commercial where you shake it all around like that. Shake it all around like that. <laughs> but yeah, guys. So um, so we're gonna get back to doing this, and I hope y'all enjoy yourselves. I love you all. And subscribe to this. I'm gonna put that at the end. Subscribe. Yes. Subscribe for Rob the Realtor.